Hey everybody, this is Daniel Stanfield, Tennessee Wildlife Resource Agency over in Region 1. Um, and we've kind of been putting together a, a few little trapping tips or whatever. And, and one of the calls I get asked all the time here in Region 1 is, there's, how do you catch armadillos? That seems to be the, the new animal that's up here that everybody's wreaking havoc in everybody's gardens and their yards. Um, and there's several different ways to, to catch them. People will take the have a heart cage traps and set them in their yard. You can catch them, but the problem with them traps is you got to put dirt or soil on the bottom of it so the animal's not stepping on the wire mesh. And a lot of times you got to fence it in. You got to put a two by four or a two by six to kind of channel and funnel that armadillo into your trap. One of the things we've had a lot of luck with over the last few years is basically an armadillo trap. And it's just a basically wooden design and with it's got two guillotine doors and the great thing about it is if you can ever catch one and get some scent in your trap they are very very highly effective uh, of catching armadillos that are causing a nuisance in your yard so oh so in other words your armadillo is going to come in and you can put funnels on these if you want or put them up against the edge of your house or your landscape rock or whatever armadillo is going to come in and if you've got some armadillo scent in here already or if it's in an area where they've had some previous rooting activity armadillo is going to come on in here come in either it's got a door on both sides with guillotine doors and you have a trigger in the middle when it hits the trigger armadillo is caught like I said it's been pretty effective this last year we probably caught about two dozen with this one trap you can make them you can buy, purchase them online but it's the, the wooden traps seem to do a lot better than the, the wire have a heart mesh traps just just a tip that might help you keep them pests out of your yard this next year